Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Kim from DIY Dream Weddings UK. I showed you how to make these lovely sunflowers in the last video, so you can go back and have a look at that, that if you want. And I also showed you how I created the back of the bouquet, which I think I'm going to be sticking this onto um, soon. Uh, if not in this video, the next one. so let me know what you think about this project so far and if you've just hopped on don't forget you can go back and see the other parts to this this project so i'm going to show you how to put this this uh tour together which is the tower on the hill okay so we're gonna you can see i've ribboned all the way around the edge of this and if you have a look back on the videos it will show you how to ribbon the back of the bouquet which is this bit here and that's exactly the same technique as it is for that little piece of, uh, for this um, tower as well. So there we go, it's the same technique for that as it is for um, back of the bouquet. So, right, so we're gonna just put that on, way around, should we put that on? So if we, we glue that on there like that. Okay, the, uh, the reason I ribbon this is to make it look neat so you don't have to see the edge of the cardboard. Okay, I use this technique a lot for a lot of my pieces that I put on my bouquet. So you can sort of see there, that's kind of sandwiched and it's really neat. You're not going to see any of that cardboard and it also strengthens, strengthens it because I'm going to put it right on the top of my bouquet. So that's going to go on the top like this. Okay, so it strengthens it. Um, so I think I will actually put that on. That's going to go on the front, okay. I don't think that will interfere too much with the back when we put the back on. I don't think it will. So I'm going to put that this piece on, I think. Yeah, so let's just turn that over and see if that's in the right place. And I think it is. I think that's in the right place. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to glue the top like this. This is all made of craft foam, okay? So that, this is what it's made of. So I'm going to just stick that. It's hot glue I'm using to stick this down, okay? Um, right, and so I'm going to just lift this bit up here. And what I like to do is go all the way around. Actually, I like to go all the way around the first bit like that and then glue it down, okay? And then go all the way around the second around the middle of the second bit. Um, I do find that it's better if you just don't worry too much about the edge and just do the middle. And then what you can do is you can go around the edge afterwards, okay? So just push that down like that. So just glue that all on like that together. And you've got your the back of your bouquet all, all stuck on, okay? And then just go around the edges if you want to and just glue the edge down like that and as you can see that is really quite nice and neat now quite nice and neat it's quite neat <laughs> quite nice and neat you know what I mean <laughs> so okay just sticking that down around the edge just making sure it's not gonna flap around too much Okay, and if you don't like the edge coming out too much, you can always trim it. Um, you can always trim it off. Okay, I don't like to see the edge of that ribbon on the inside. So, yeah, I think that's just about it. I will go around a bit more later on when the rest is dry. Okay, and that is basically, and don't worry about this because when you put your top piece on, that will cover this piece up, okay? Because we're gonna put some more foam on this side. Okay, so that is the front of your bouquet. And I'm gonna put this on now. So we'll put that on there, like that. Just gonna put a little bit of glue on there. So that's the top of the hill. I might do some sheep in the field as well. <laughs> 
but I'm not sure how I'm going to make them. <laughs> so that's how that's all put on. And we're going to put the handle in the back like that after we've put the foam on, okay? Um, let me know if what you thought about this video and thanks for watching um, if you do. And uh, do, don't forget to press the like if you like what you see on here and maybe give us a comment below. And uh, if you do like these videos, do subscribe to this channel um, as you'll get more videos pop up just like this one and uh, it will help the channel to grow as well. Thank you everybody so much for your support and thanks to all those new subscribers as well. Have a happy Friday and a nice weekend and I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.